he's connected with us and and this is a this is a picture of healthy family where irrespective of hormones and life experiences and external stimuli and all those things that home home is a place where you can lay your head down yeah yeah and and be loved and be seen and learn how to receive we talk about why marriages marriages are in trouble because they don't know how to receive love and that's for those of you listening i, I, I hope this leaves you with a, a visual picture of what it looks like to receive love mm -hmm. and if you didn't grow up in an environment where you were were taught how to receive love this is a picture of what it looks like we've been given a a, a model in in, in where John is, you know, lays often lays his head against the chest yeah. of Jesus and yeah. hears his heartbeat and that that picture of just complete, yeah. I am completely safe, yes. I am completely seen, mm -hmm. and I'm yeah. and it's good. Yeah, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. <laughs> we before we jump to our part two. I want to put a little button on this. Uh, we, we say that we believe this, that the wisdom of God is cloaked in simplicity. You know, you got this family expert on here and he, he's written all these books to me and he's just telling me like the secret to everything is just connect with your heart, connect with your family. And I want to say, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> but that, we, we, we to preach it like this, Jason, that it's about oneness. That's yeah. the language. Yeah, that's it. That's Father, it. With husband with wife, father with yeah. son, us with yeah. Jesus and the Father, That's and that it. oneness. That word means I love this. When you dig it out, it means mutually indwelling. Come on, man. That's it, it means nothing separating. So there's no That's part it. of me mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually that you don't have access to, Leslie, yeah. and vice versa, or child. Yeah. Like we are. There's nothing that's separate. We are mutually indwelling God and us together as one. And that's exactly what you're talking about. Where there is yes, no separation. Yes, that's exactly it. No separation. And that, and it, that is an answer. Go ahead. I'm yeah. sorry. That's a design. Go ahead. No, that's it. That, well, when you realize there's no separation in God, there's no separation, and God is love, then then that's exactly That's the prayer Jesus prayed. I pray that they would be one. Yes. That they would know this oneness that I share with the Father, just you know, just as we share it, Father, they would too share it. And then what did he say? He said, when they know this oneness that we have with, with you and with each other, the whole world, yes. that's what you get back to what you're talking about, man. It's the model. Oh. If we could know this union, then we're the model for the whole world. The whole world would know that you are my Father, that I am your Son, that you sent me, that this is uh, the revelation of what it means to be human, of what it means to be fully present in the moment. Uh, it, it's what you're talking about. And it changes cultures. It's what what we're talking about. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. No, that's you know, fine. You don't apologize. It's, I'm just <laughs> glad that a, a theologian is, is affirming what I'm thinking. That makes me feel <laughs> a lot more secure. <laughs>